Hello, everybody. Uh, this is Blanca Rangel. I'm going to show you how to solve problem 12.45 of night. OK. So first of all, this problem says how fast and they want the result in revolutions per minute. With a five kilogram, 22 centimeter diameter, and it's a bowling ball, have to spin to have an angular momentum of 0 0.23 kilograms meter per second square. Okay. So first of all, I'm going to make a drawing, of course. So I'm going to draw volume ball. I'm going to make my axis of rotation to be the middle. Kind of in and out of the page. So my ball is going to rotate. Um, this is positive, right? Because remember, angular momentum or just momentum in general is a vector, always has a direction. For rotation, clockwise is in the negative direction and counterclockwise is in the positive direction. So we're going to assume that this um, bowling ball is going to spin counterclockwise because it's positive. Okay. So it's asking us to have momentum. As you remember, for linear, for linear momentum, and that's with a P, equals mass times velocity, okay? So in this case, we're going to do angular momentum. L and the equivalent of mass in in rotation, it's inertia. And the equivalent of velocity in rotation is angular velocity. Okay. So we have a bowling ball. I think the first thing that we need to find out is inertia because we need we have momentum we need we need inertia and we're going to find angular speed so i'm going to look at this figure And let's look at this. So a bowling ball is a sphere. So a sphere with the axis about the diameter. OK, that's good. So our momentum formula is Two fifth mass times radius. Okay. So momentum equals two fifths mass times radius square. So the radius, so the diameter is 22 times 10 to the minus 2 meters. So the radius is. 11 times 10 to the minus 2 meters. OK, so angular momentum is 2 fifths mass radius. Square. OK, so I'm going to calculate that. 
So 0 0.11, well, 11 e to the minus 2, 0 0.11, mm -hmm. a square, times 5, times 2, over 5. Okay. So moment of inertia is 0 0.0245. Kilogram meter square. Now we're going to do angle. Now we have momentum and inertia, and we need to find speed. So linear moment, angular momentum equals inertia times speed. So momentum over inertia equals speed. So we have a momentum of 0 0.23, an inertia of 0 0.0245. So let's do that. Okay. So we have an angular speed of 9.50 radians per second. Okay. Now we want this speed, not in radius per second, but revolutions per minute. So, I have angular equals 9.50, radians up, seconds down. For radians up, radians down, and revolutions. So one revolution is two pi r radians, seconds down, seconds up, and one minute equals 60 seconds. Okay, so our result, we're going to divide over 2 pi mm -hmm. or 2 pi, multiply them 60. And our answer is 90.75 revolutions per minute. And that's around, yep, yeah, around 91. All right, thank you. If you have any more questions, don't hesitate to contact us. All right, thank you.